that's how we kind of customize how the character plays in the level. So we got the burst and uh, the lightning. We'll go with the burst. Burst. So these things, the, the wisp bonds are used uh, for two purposes. One is to attack enemies, and the second is to traverse the level. So we'll go ahead and get started here. So there we are with our own original character. All right, perfect. Now, how many different type of wisps are there? There's quite a few different so types of, okay. of, of wisp bonds, and that they all allow you right to do a lot of different things. Okay. Um, you have more than one wisp bond. For combos? You you can't combo them, but what you can do is swap them out in between levels anytime. Oh, okay. Or, or replay like a level. Man. Yeah, you can like replay a level and be like, oh, I want to try it, you know, with this now. Let's see here, we'll go this way. Perfect. So this is like a, a Green Hill style setting, but very, very different. Uh, wow. in this case, it's got the yeah, the desert. Uh, Eggman's kind of taken over in mm -hmm. this game, so that's the key storyline. Beat is that Eggman has taken over the world, and it's up to you, both Sonics and uh, your own original character to fight back. Let's go this way. Perfect. So I can use this by holding down R2. Can just kind of like unleash the flamethrower there. All right, perfect. We're gonna go this direction. And avoid those giant crab guys. You'll see in the in the uh, cutscenes there, all, a lot of the characters from the past Sonic games also make appearances here. 